Yo, this is a quick, quick video, okay? I'm heading out, but I want to drop this video real quick. This happened yesterday. So, um, the title of this video is going to be, um, how do you handle a dominant woman, okay, um, in a conversation, okay? Okay, quick story. Um, I had a friend, one of my peoples, had a birthday for his homegirl. His homegirl was having a birthday party. She invited us. You understand? She invited him and turn invited me and a few other people went up there, or whatever. Okay, this is at a casino, so she had a room, a couple of rooms, and her friends up there, and all kind of craziness is about to ensue, right? Okay, so we get there kind of late because I, I never rush. I get so I go when I get there, I go when I get there. So unless it's important, okay, this is something that just kind of flew by night, and um. We put something together, waiting for this guy, waiting for that guy. You know how it goes. So somebody's always not ready. So um, we end up getting there anyway. So we end up uh, getting falling to the spot. It's jumping. You know, it's, like, it's a casino, so it's popping. Okay? And um, so we get to the girl. We, everybody meets up, whatever. Everything's cracking. We go downstairs to have drinks, you know. So now we're at the bar. Okay? Now, and this is late, so some people are still coming in, some people are still coming in and meeting up with her and Ray Pop, you know, it was a big deal, right? So, and I don't know the chick, so they're kind of like, yo, it's X, this is this and that, this, this and that. So, when people know everybody, hey, ho, 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 but I was like, okay, I'm just chilling, I'm just, you know, flying the wall here and shit, right? So, but I'm holding my frame, and that's the key, right? So, I'm at the bar, and it's... We, we take up the whole bar and just, you know, having a good time. Everybody's talking and, you know, whatever, right? And she's like, I know you from somewhere and this and that. So we're all talking. Everybody's everybody's coagulating, okay? And then here comes these, these three girls, right? Now, they they have their the presence very, very, um, um, I won't say ratchet, but they were very thug. You know, they were thug and matter of fact and, you know, yo, yo, one of those. Now, now if you were in a club with, with a girl like this, and say you saw a girl you liked, she behaved like a, like a cock blocker. You understand? So if you saw a girl that was really, 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 really cute, and that was her girlfriend, that, that'd be the girl. She'd be the chick that'd be like, 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 what's your name? And where you come from? And how's your family? And, you know, what do you do? And what your family do? Something like that. You'd be like, you know, what the fuck? I just I don't know any of you guys. What the fuck? You know? So she was one of those type. Okay? So picture that. Right? And I'm chilling because I'm... I get no fucks to give. I don't know anybody. I'm having a great time with my peoples here. You know, everybody's happy, and we're, I'm, we're trading off drinks and everything, right? So these these girls walk up, you know, and they're loud. And the casino's kind of loud, but they come up extra loud, you know? So I'm going to go into a little little satire to bring you into the situation, right? She comes up to everybody like, who's this? Okay, who are you guys? Who's this? Who's that? You know, who? hello? I'm, who are you? She's kind of tall or whatever, right? Not important, but she felt she felt as if that was even significance, you know. She thought that meant a significant thing that she was. It doesn't really didn't, but the fact that she was making herself loud, one of those loud, you know, already lit, had some drinks in already. So she's like, "Look at me, everybody! Hey, hey!" Meanwhile, it's her girlfriend's birthday. You understand? So this is the combative dynamic in female version. Other videos I talk about dynamics and value. Check that video out. You know how do you tell high profile, high um, high value, and low value uh, people? All right, um, the traits that there are. So check out that video, and I'll explain it. But this is a female version of a competitive dynamic. All right. Now, in this case, like the video that gives you, I give you a value. The value video that I just talked about is mentioned. I tell you how to um, balance. And gain the control of the situation and monitor and be, and be alpha in that frame and, and, and create the environment that's energy is based on your vibe. You understand? That's for guy to guy. Okay. You're making your friends or coworkers feel a certain way. This is someone on the other side of the fence. Okay. This is a male to female interaction in a dating situation, a possible relationship or a sexual situation so it's a little different than co-workers or friendly environment or friendly setting this is more of a um you know something can happen sexual um a, a neighborhood of you know interactions could be a possible somebody can get not you know someone get banged out all right simply put but not that that was the case but the fact that matters this is not your joe schmo family friendly conversation this is a male or female energy interaction 
okay? So she started She started right away, because I, I, when she came in, I kind of, you know, I'm up there to the bar, so I'm just chilling. I have no idea. And she's talking, saying something like, who is he? Who are you? Who are you? To my man's answer. She's like, oh, he's so-and-so's brother, and you know that guy. No, no, no. She's like, oh, okay, now who's that? You know, she's pointing to me. Now, I'm, I'm facing the bar. I'm watching TV, and I'm looking, because I guess they're all talking, so I'm kind of like, you know, but I'm standing up. You know, my chair's right there. I'm standing up, right? So I'm kind of, I'm looking like this. I'm just looking. And I turn, you know, it's like, who's this? And, I, and she turns and says, oh, that's, that's excellent. Blah, blah. And I had a hat on that said boss, right? It said boss across here, boss, right? So um, I turn, boom. So I'm looking at them now. Now I'm looking at the group and I'm facing like this. So I'm looking, right? And so she starts to say, like, who are you? I got this. Now, who are you? What? Boss, boss. Boss, what are you, boss? You the boss or some shit like that? But she was saying it so loud, people stopped gambling. Just like, what the fuck is going? Is it a fight? Security started coming around. Security started gathering on the corners of the bar, like like something's gonna pop off. You know what I'm saying? So I knew right away that was a test. It was a test. Okay, I said, oh, this bitch is gonna try to test it, brother. She don't know she must with the wrong person. You know what I'm saying? So I sat here and held my frame, but now I'm facing. I'm facing this way, but I want to show you guys. I'm facing this way now because everybody in the bar is lined up, okay? And um, so I turn to face her. She goes, so you the boss? you the boss? Like, what's your ball, boss? And I'm going, I said, yeah, I guess so. I guess I am the boss. I'm the boss. I said, what's your name? Who are you? I said, who are you? And then she said something. I said, who are you? She said, I can't say her name, whatever. She says, blah, whatever. I go, blue? She goes, no, blah. I go, Oh, Blue. Nice to meet you, Blue. And her friend starts cracking up, like, oh, snap. And she started getting more, she's like, and getting more animated, like, wait, wait. And so, hands flying and everything, and I'm sitting there like this, and just looking at it. But see, I'm holding the frame that I'm not fucking playing with you. You know what I'm saying? I don't know you, and you're beneath me. So, but I'm smiling. I'm pleasant. So I got, I got, my energy is right. No, 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 okay. I said, yeah, okay. I said, okay, Blue. That's, that makes sense, you know, Wow, wow, oh wow, you know, da da da, and I don't do that. I said, wow, you know, says, you know what I'm saying? I says, I said, I'm a seasoned vet, baby. So, you know, I've seen it all, done it all. This is nothing new to me, you understand? So, you know, but continue. I, I like what you're saying, though. I like the, the anger. You know, I, like, I like it. It's good energy, you know? And she's like, what? Yo, and, and now, now everybody at the bar is laughing at her, you know, because so so her friend was like, oh, snap, you know, because they're, they're laughing at her because she's so emphatically upset and angry. And see, here's the deal, guys. When when a woman is testing you like that, she likes you, right? She figured, you know, let me see where I can push this guy. Because if I could break him, he ain't shit. Because she's probably thinking, he ain't shit, you know, because I'm chilling. I didn't respond. I could look at him with a smile just like this. See, I'm, I'm indifferent. I'm unaffected by her bullshit. Her fuckery was to, to a 10 level. Because security's like, yo, should we come in there and... You know, should we be, but they could see my demeanor that I was just chill. You understand? So, her friends were like, yo, why don't you, you know, calm down. Why don't you chill, you know? But till I, till I broke on her fucking ass, you know, I got, I couldn't, I didn't get a name right. I refused to give her the right name, you know. Don't be doing this and go in the bar and create an environment because somebody might flip out on you, you know what I'm saying? You, it's just that kind of environment. You just don't know. My point is she's ratchet. She could have got on the phone and started calling some dudes, calling brothers and all that and all that. But I'm not worried about that. I got my goon squad. That was not a big deal. So, that wasn't even an issue. I already knew. I, I perceive, I could see what her body language was doing and her eyes and her all her IOIs that I was ignoring, I knew exactly her interest and her high level. She see me somewhere where she, I'm, I was a five. I'm like, ah, who's, who's this? Yeah, whatever. How you doing? You cute. But, you know, that's the attitude she had. You understand? I'm like, bitch, I'm not even looking at you. You, I really, I see you not, you know? Oh, I'm cute. Oh, I'm glad you think so. That's my attitude was like, yeah, I'm very cute. I'm very handsome. You know what I'm saying? I'm very this and that. So whatever she was saying, my physical presence and my energy was reflecting it without saying the words. Out the look, my smile, my, my relaxed energy was like, I know I'm that. That's what you're talking about. You don't even know who you're talking to. So she couldn't get me frazzled up. My eyes didn't flicker. You know, I didn't change my body position. I didn't get uncomfortable. Because these are the small micro indicators. She's a professional 
punker. That shit was your pro. She's from the hood. You understand? Her man probably gets all like, radical. Yeah, what you mean? Do I put up or, you know? We don't know. I don't know her. I could be totally wrong with that. But I know one thing, that she's totally ratchet alpha type, you know, that she has to dominate the room. Because it wasn't her birthday, remember? It was the other girl's birthday. But she came in there just kind of like, you know, rah, 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 you know, me, 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 you know? So after I was like, I don't know your name. I, what's, what is it again? Boom, boom. And her friends was laughing. I was like, eh. So I turned, boom, watch TV. I said, okay, nice meeting you. Turn, watch TV. So I got the laugh. They're still laughing. They're like, oh, snap, da 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 da. And she's looking like, oh. And she got flushed like a seep in the corner of my eye. She was just like, I could see her arms just drop. So her body language from from, from her, my pro, my perceptive, my my perceptive, I could see her perspective here from the side. I can see that she dropped her shoulders and dropped her arms, like, like. Like, like what? Like, and and gave that that look. Like, so she walked away from the bar, and I said, "Uh huh, she's gonna come around again." I'm looking at TV, I'm watching whatever, you know. And then, and when she left, they're all laughing and laughing. Like, oh snap, yo, she likes you. She wanna, she wanna get you, you know. And I'm like, yeah, whatever, you know. But you know, I had to walk over. And when she left, I went over to those people and explained to them. I that I created that environment. I said, I knew, like, I created that. You understand? I created that by holding the frame, you know. She, now, had I not had a real holding a real frame, steel, and, 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 and emotionally steel in nature, she would have tore me apart. Any little fringe or, um, wait, I'm sorry, my bad. She would have took my head off. She was already there. She was all, a past ten. Okay, remember that. So, the fact that I remain, this is like this. He's he's. She had to go back and regroup. She took off, went behind a machine somewhere with her girls. And but matter of fact, wrong. Her girls stayed with me. And they was talking and laughing. Yo, what's up with that? What happened? Do you know her? I said, I, don't, I know. I know these two here, and no, and the birthday girl. That's all I didn't know. I mean, I, I, now I know y'all, of course. But and they were laughing. Wow, she was. Yo, she was. She likes you. She like. She's like yo because she never get talked to that way. You understand? So it was brand new to her. You know. I don't give a fuck. I still, it's not my type, whatever, you know. So she comes back and, you know, uh, well, she rubs up against me. She brings up a, a right breast, left breast. She's trying to squeeze down between the chairs. It's such a small space, you understand? So, but what I do, I didn't turn and go, huh, 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 huh. she rubbed my shoulder, you know, two titties to my shoulder. No, she turned, she rubbed right titty. Left titty on my shoulder, and then turn and put her ass on me, you know, and you know I'm I'm unaffected. I'm pretending I don't I don't even see it. Not even I'm not even interested. Now, not only did I'm now I'm punishing her for her behavior. You understand? To put her now she knows that she's putting herself out there to really get my attention. She's already physically making the contact kinesthetically. Okay, she needs to be touched kinesthetically. Okay, so then she turns around. When she gets to a little situation, stands next to me. I'm, already, I'm still standing up. I'm holding my frame, watching TV, you know. And she's uh, she starts to explain herself. You know, oh, I had a long day. This and that. I'm so glad to be out. Da, da, da. Runs down a whole story. I just look straight at her. Now, now I'm looking straight at her like this. And she's telling me whatever. I'm going, hmm, okay. All right. Talking a whole story. Oh, really? Oh, wow. And she goes, now she goes, me and you, we got, we got like our, our, like our, our spirits are like connected, you know, we got, we got like connected, you know, and like connected. And I'm going, oh yeah, yeah, connected. Okay. All right. Yeah. yeah. She said, and then she goes, let's, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go upstairs. Let's go walk around. I'm like, nah, I'm good right here. I'm good right here. You know? So listen guys. So the point of the story is that, you know, she and then after that, I said that she left again, took another walk, and her friend was like, "Oh, I think she left." This now, where'd so and so go? And you know, whatever. And um, because what happened was, I I actually actually did she leave? No, I left. She was at the bar, standing there. I said, "No, no, no." I took my drink, and I walked around. So I took a walk, all right, around the casino, whatever. And then she got up and walked. And I was gone for a minute. So I walked around checking the machines out. You know, I like Wheel of Fortune, you know. But I don't play. I don't gamble. So I don't really play the, the slots and all that stuff. I don't do any of that stuff. 
So, I mean, if I really had to, I'd play a nickel slot or something. I don't know. But I really don't get, you know, the environment's cool, but whatever. So, I actually come back about 10 minutes or so, whatever. And she goes, oh, where's so-and-so? Did you guys walk together? I said, no, I went over here. They were like, oh, okay. And then her friend home goes like, listen. She says, I don't know, but she just acts so weird just now. I don't know what happened. You know, I said, she said I, was, I was getting upset. I was going to. See, here's the deal, guys. When a girl acts out of a character like that, you know, that's her character. She's she's like that, you know. She's aggressive. Arr! But the, her friend never saw her respond that way. You understand? Because I was why? Because I was holding the frame and I was clear my intent. You gotta have. You gotta be clear of heart. You know. You gotta have it clear here that you really you gotta be. You gotta have something. You, you gotta be on your mission in life. If you're not doing that, you'll get torn up out here. Women can see it. They can feel. It, they can smell it. Okay, you ain't have to. I didn't say much at all. I said maybe five percent of anything. You know, she did all the work, walking around, resetting, walking around, cooling herself off, walking around. Now she's moist. She had to go off, walk around. You understand? I didn't do anything. Five percent, just a little bit. I didn't. I didn't tell her get the fuck out of here. What I didn't do, everything short of that. Don't you go doing that. You know, and, 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 you know, playing, you know, hard and all. I'm not saying to do that. But with this personality, I knew what I was in for. And I knew what to, had to, how to gauge that. Okay? So, she was extreme. So, I had to really just keep my energy where it is. Period. But my thing is to not let her shake. Don't let a woman shake your energy frame. You understand that? That's what you, that's, yeah, keep yourself congruent to who you are. Don't let the woman change your energy frame. That's the main thing. Because when you shift or change your mind, or you're thinking twice, what should I say? You're done. If you gotta think, what kind what, what of, should, what should you're fucking done. You're done. She's gonna embarrass you for everybody you know. She's gonna get, she's gonna embarrass you. She's gonna take, she's gonna take your fucking head off. Because number one, you fucking playing with it. She, she, she approached you, and you, you, she thought you were somebody you weren't. You failed the test. Now you gotta pay for it. She's gonna punish you. She's gonna punish you. But, the other thing opposite happened here because I already seen I already seen the fuckery. And I was like, yo, you know, I already see this coming. I know how to play this hand. I seen this hand before. I got the two jacks, the ace, I got the deuce of diamonds. I, I know how to play this hand right here. So and I did. Okay. And she's very impressed. So that was the whole point. And women know these things, but the whole point, guys, was that she brought on a strong, strong alpha frame. No matter who brings a frame like that to you, you can get, you can just be who you are, be congruent, and stay alpha. You stay alpha in your frame, and don't, don't fucking pause to think about should I fucking? Oh wait, you're fucking done. That's it. You blew it. You blew the set. Even if you did blow the set, you know a little bit more, a little bit more than you did last time, and you just keep trying, you keep going at it. But you have to be out in these streets, guys. To get the the knowledge, I don't mean in the streets literally. I mean if you're at work or you you know do the work as far as approaching women, um, or not approaching them per se. I don't, I don't mean cold approach. What I mean is be able to gauge a woman's interest to some degree. You know, just get better at that. If there's an interaction that happens, I'm not saying go create. Hey, I gotta start meeting five girls a day. I'm not telling you that. What I'm saying is, should a woman should the opportunity approach or come up, you have to be able to get better at gauging. You know where a woman is at, okay? And that that right there, that's elite level game because I I dominated her. I gave her dom game, and I was explaining to my friends. I said, yeah, you know why she couldn't? You know why she walked away? Because I dom I dommed on her. You know, I gave her dom game. She had totally died, totally dominated her. She's a dominant female, but then she just got dominated, and automatically she just she just showered, just showered with the fucking physical, the mental change. Her body dropped. And just her body broke down. When her shoulders dropped down, I knew right away she was submissive at that point to me, to me, which is rare. Okay, that's why she couldn't. She couldn't. She didn't know what to. She had to have because again, remember she rubbed against me, so she's she's you know kinetically you know wired to to touch, you know, embracing, holding, feeling. Once once you've earned it through her little obstacle course of bullshit. Then you that's what she that's the reward. But she needs to feel right away a physical, a grab, you know, you know, and it's gotta do with being hood and all that. But her language is to hug or hold. You understand? So what she did, hey, let's go upstairs or let's go, let's go here, grab my hand. And I took my hand back. I said, nah, let's I'm chilling right here, you know. I'm chilling, you know, I'm good, you know. 
So I had to really boom. And she's like, oh, okay. Oh, okay, okay. All of a sudden, it's a big change. Little girl now. She was a big bear before, but now she's a little girl. You know, so it's just that easy, guys. But you got to have, you got to really know what the fuck you're doing. But you get there. You'll get there, guys. All right? Yo, this was a quick video, but I got to get, I gotta get to the, I got to get out of here and do some things. All right? More stories, more content. But listen, stay in your frame. Don't let a woman shake you. Don't second guess yourself around a woman that, that confronts you or tries to test you. Always realize that it's only a test. It's only a test. Okay, if she she must she, if she didn't like you, she wouldn't test you. Okay, she just she'll look at you not even there. She'll ignore you. Women are very good at doing that. Okay, moving you from their fucking environment. When they, if, they, if they don't like you, they have totally totally remove you from their environment. Okay, but if she's she testing you this and that, she's got a high value for you. She likes you a little bit. You got some interest in there, but you got to pass the test to go all the way. All right, yo, it's Robbie XL living my best life. Hope you are too. Like, subscribe, comment below.